bust their head open. Right here. Nothing left but wiggles. We're gonna talk about this demand though. We have customer demand. We're gonna tell you how this word play a big role in the world and in situations. Stuff like that. But now we have wids versus squids. And they, they have even, they, they've started war. They are the different octopus. This is a form of demand from children. Whenever they want something, when it's crying for stuff and demanding stuff like that. Driven Institute, WWW, that type of stuff. The eighth, you know, new stuff coming in the back of your head right now. You know what I'm saying? Gold edition. Lady, you know, we have the man more. What else we have? P. Diddy. Worm is different type of demands. Spiritual, physical, mental. You got a minute? Oh, yeah, sure. Come on in, Quagmire. Listen, um, I need to ask you to do something. And, and it's something huge. Like I mean, it's like the biggest thing a guy could ever ask his friend to do. We look at the flesh and we see, we put pieces together. You have initiations. Like you have a choice in a matter, but it's really ultimatums, meaning they they give you a route. You can take this and some ooze behind them. We have Satan, Kermit right now coming for your soul, puppets, and then we have puppet masters to demon people and in the world world daily. A lot of stuff is on demand, demand and stuff like that. And Jesus, who are hated, demanded, hated in demand, follow tortured demands of, of what they want. Hey, we're best pals, right? Whatever you need. All right, and you have to understand, I would never ask you to do this if I had any other choice. And if what were at stake was anything less. Jeez, Quagmire, what is it? <sighs> Charmise won't give me a divorce because she doesn't believe I'm gay. People to do as a whole in the world. What is demand? How much of something people want? Intentional spiritual evil. That's what the free will, free will is based on. Intentional evil. Either way, Satan demands a, a sacrifice, AKA snack. You're just a snack at the end of the day. What you do when you finish with a snack, throw it away, move on. The Miramar family is in mourning tonight after an eight-month-old baby. The Miramar family is in mourning tonight after an eight-month-old baby mauled to death by the family dog. CBS 4's Ted Scallon spoke to the family. He's live outside the home. And Ted, this is a terrible tragedy. What did the family tell you how this happened? Well, the mother said that she's just stunned. At this point, she told me she can't even figure out what her emotions are. What happened is just so horrible. This morning, she dropped her young daughter off at this house right here for the grandmother to babysit, and that's when the fatal attack happened. You know, you never know. It will play out just like the elements, and the elements demand the worship of people, negative energy, the negativity. Different cities, states, and towns, the days of now, the days of the back of their head, not enough but wiggles, ooze juice, some skins, <laughs> get this rat. What it boils down to, different squids. We have market demand, schedule, inventory, shippings, whatever the case. I gave you this image here before for different situations. And um, just get deeper and deeper with this information because we in high demand with this information. The whole world want to know HBO, but for the big channels, the exclusive, you have to get that demand. You know, same with the elements. Thank you. Woo. That is why I won't do two shows a night anymore, babe. I won't. I won't do. Well. What do we got here tonight, kids? Ooh, uh, well, we got the, uh, the Maitlands. Uh, I think uh, they've had enough exercise for a night. Earthquakes, all of, all of that stuff. The world, don't, the world itself don't sleep. If you believe the sun goes down and the world doesn't turn, so everybody 
forget a piece of that sun. Then, 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 smite the squid out yourself. Zoom out. That's it right there. Look like some love and hip hop type of stuff. It's real life. Real forecasting. Real demands. Real things taking place. It's overlooked, but it's a big one. Because everybody's always wondering. We need to know the forecast so we can know how to go about that day, evening, morning, spin them around and around. Shadow gods, shadow gods, shoes. We start off and then we cordially get into them. That's what this storyline based on. I take days sometimes, days, but believe me you, you're gonna get the full package, the whole package, the whole meal, dessert, and then some. How this movie show difficult people based on demands premiered August 5th, Wednesday. So I, you know, put this in the storyline, difficult people. We dealing with difficult people as is in the world who uh, demands things, rather they use powers of evil, do stuff for them, money, evil intentions. Oh, they said, okay, boys. Okay, so the nigga that we talking about tonight is Cassidy. Yes. And so, Tell me a little bit about how you met Cassidy. Well, I was following Cassidy on Instagram. So, you know, I got in his inbox. I asked him if he had any new music coming out. Uh-huh. And, you know, he sent me the link of the new song he had out or whatever. And hold that so, thought. For- We're going to do this in steps. So I'm going to show them the, the message right there. I panned it over to the screen. This is the message. She says, I love you, Cassidy. When you putting out more music? He sends her the link. And now it looks like that you sent like some type of booty picture. What is that that you sent him underneath that? Oh, it's a picture of me turking. I'm turking on my bed. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, and then and what happened from there? Um, he filed, he started to request to follow me. So he started um, you know, looking at my pictures, going through my pictures and things like that. Mm-hmm. And then we started um, you know, messaging back and forth and we end up exchanging numbers. Okay. And so this is where well, I, I gave have... her my number. I gave her my number first. Okay. And so I want to break some of these receipts down. So I'm going to let the people, I'm going to break down these receipts for the people. And then we're going to go into a deep dive. It goes on and on. And we have another baby. Most babies get their way. You know, same thing with animals. You know what I mean? Nonetheless. And how do you deal with difficult people? You know, they deal with you because they can't survive without people such as us. They fail folks like me, since I'm cool, you know, he is a people's person. You know, I could come back around at any given time, do whatever, whatever. You know, he's forgiven. No, only thing I'm forgiven is the back of your head. Zoom in, the back of a squid. You ain't seen the back of a squid yet? On a leash, dog leash, you know? And bullying and, and, and uh, mental. You walk on pins and needles, scared to get fired, scared to uh, be replaced. You know what I mean? That's what the world is. That's what most people is usually based on. They then become the hot demand that everybody wants, the new face. I told you not to drink all those frescas before we got in the car. Mother, please. You're embarrassing me. No, I'm not. Seymour needs the toilet. His bladder's full. Full of urine. Yeah, thanks. It's just past the end of the bar, next to the heavy set guy. I had to come. I had to come correct. And then, once I came correct, I said it's, it's squid time. It's research time. I'm not gonna lose y'all. So as long as you're keeping up, you won't get left. In exchange for helping us, I will personally speak to the parole board about reducing your sentence. Pass. Pass? 
That deal don't work for Eddie Plant. You want the fire blaster's help, he has some demands. Demands? The bifocal blaster is here, by the way. I want an island. More, you know, slave mentality, stuff like that. And then once they drain them, they do it all over again. You know, Johnny always feel right. You know, as if they're telling the truth. They say, you know what? I do have a family. I have bills, children. Let me just do what the boss say. You know, everybody else doing it. Is this him? Is this you? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, cute. White, but cute. <laughs> what I don't understand is, why did he come back? I don't know. Why is he still here? He's stuck, that's what it is. He's in between worlds. Long as they good, basically. They don't tell you. See me? I, I, I don't wanna see people stupid or down or no money. Or, or, you know, just, just feeling some type of way. I have some demands. Yeah, of course, of course. Nobody can ever know. Absolutely, I'm right there with you on that one. There will be no kissing on the mouth. Okay. I changed my mind. There will be kissing on the mouth. Oh, uh, all right. Good. Now, what else? What else? Uh, yes, if perchance it is beautiful, I reserve the right to cry. Peter, I can't imagine any scenario where this is going to be beautiful. Okay, so this looks like you guys have been writing back and forth. Um, and yeah. let me pull these receipts over to you. Okay, Cassidy says, what city are you, you in? You said, I'm from New Jersey, but I've been living in Philadelphia for four months now. He asked you, are you bisexual? You said, yes, I am. What made you ask that? He said, I'm married. I don't cheat. You said, sorry, I never knew you was married. I'm sorry, but it's not cheating. We all having fun. He said, that's why I asked you the, that question. Send your number. And then he did like a, a like a like a face emoji. You said, why are you shaking your head? He said, I text that number. And you said, you did not text me. With the others, we get the results that we have now. Oozed out, squitted out people. I'm the housewife now. Look at me. Men, and proud of it. Women, they flip the genders already with homosexuality. So now, make them feel less of a man. You get this. So meanwhile, individuals such as myself, nonetheless, it's different type of rituals. You don't need to be in the gang or any of that stuff to be doing rituals. You could be an ordinary person doing or trying to do rituals and even if you do rituals or satanic stuff and it fails the intention god look he said okay you was gonna do it if it went through anyway so conspiracy same stuff what cops do it's the same stuff heavy set what's that supposed to mean all right take it easy take it easy i'm just saying you ain't no uh tommy toon no tommy toon eh oh that's it you insulted my honor I you what now? I demand satisfaction. Oh! I challenge you to a duel. Hey, a duel? Are you in that little extreme? Here, here, have a free beer. Really? But you've never given anyone a free beer. I ain't never been slapped with no dueling glove before either. I said I gotta keep applying pressure. I gotta give y'all this truth. Research. Major prophecy. Be myself. You know and tell you about these demands. Different jobs, different things that's in demand. Demons and spirits, dumb, super dumb, super, super saying stupid. And then a lot of them aren't. Some of them are doctors, lawyers, detectives, very, very rich people, you know, who feel as if we're lower than them. All these channels, flicks, showcase, pay a little extra money for it, but you could get it, you know, and more. They demand it, you know, backed by popular demand. And since this is the eighth god of back, the take back and, and, and all of that, 
Why not add the man? Why not? Let's do it. I'm not going to lose you. You know, this is a God, very powerful one, that you'll be seeing in a ninth God. You, you know what happens sometimes? The, the spirit gets yanked out so quick that the essence still feels like it has work to do on here. Would you stop rambling? I don't think I'm rambling. I'm just answering a question. He's got an attitude now. I don't have an attitude. Yes, you do have an attitude. We have a little discussion. If you didn't have an attitude, you would not have raised your voice to me now, would you? God damn it. Don't you God damn it me. Don't you take the Lord's name in vain with me. You understand? I don't take Would that. You relax. Man. No, you relax. You're the dead guy. You want me to help you? You better apologize. Because oh, I don't Jesus take that from Christ. me. That's it. I'm leaving. I, I'm leaving. Nobody talks to me like that. You understand me? Now you better apologize. I'm sorry. I apologize. Okay? Now would you sit down? You're gonna see, you're gonna see it again. That's just that's that's how I'm feeling. You ever be in, in mind, you're rushing, you need to be somewhere. They taking a long time playing intentionally and then intentionally or just impatient. We even have this where you see people in, in these rallies. Some do it for the violence, guns, things going on. But overall, this is a form of demands. They're demanding that people do something about what's going on. And if not, they're gonna stand up like a million squids, stand around, all of that type of stuff. I, I've never been to these type of rallies, but I could just imagine I've even shown some of them. Hmm. You're not getting an island. Then I want a full pardon. I want to get out of here for good. And after I do, I don't want to pay no taxes, like forever. And I want to stealth attack helicopter like they Okay, so the wiretaps got leaked yesterday. Now, more information on these wiretaps came out actually on these wiretaps. Remember, 50 Cent, um, at the, the Strat video, okay, uh, there was reports of gunfire at the video, okay? okay? So, this means that they were involved with that, okay? Let's get into this one. Uh, okay, so we got this whole thing. Yeah, yeah. This whole thing is getting better and better for Takashi. They keep painting him as the victim versus a co-conspirator, a co-defendant, okay? Really, they were just taking advantage of Takashi, and I think that the the defense lawyer for Takashi is going to say that he was a victim, he was being extorted and trying to be controlled by these guys. They want more staff. Teachers be out there. They want more pay. You have these construction workers underpaid. You have folks like me. I want out of your state. <laughs> Simple as zoom out. Shadow gods, diamonds, ooze juice, cycle protest funding for cycling. You see the recycle bins. They they demand that people put the recycle in the in and recycle and put the trash. Just that simple. We know how the world works. We know that the ritualists never stop. It's in every country for every different name. Um, there's a Hollywood in every culture, from China to Africa to Israel to, to even back in the days with the Egyptians. Famous people you 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 still see and hear about. And and they kill off the good ones. Same, same stuff, people. Nothing changes, no justice. No peace, no squids. Told you, squid boo boo. Not enough but wiggles. You ever seen something wiggle when it's dying? It's five o'clock. It's five o'clock. I can't go to horseman. I can't go to horseman. So, um, I told my, you know, I don't think my dad understood. I didn't complain. I just went out in the street and handled mine. And so my dad, like, how come you can't go to that school? I'm like, yeah, there's a gang of rolling 60s up there. I mean, like, they know I'm from H Ray, just and that and the other. I don't think my dad understood. I didn't complain. I just went out in the street and handled mine. And so my dad, like, how come you can't go to that school? I'm like, yeah, there's, there's a gang of rolling 60s up there. I mean, like, they know I'm from a trade, just and that and the other.
And I'm like, I can't pull 365 days out of that place. Everybody handled their life. Daddy went to work, handled his life, came home, paid the bills. Mom went to work, handled her life. I went to school and handled my life. I didn't want to come home. Just then I went out there and handled mine, came back home. But once he realized what was going on and where we was at, then uh, I didn't tell him to. He just said, okay. He had the money. He didn't know it was that bad. You know what I'm saying? Because everything in demand. They want the real. They want the truth. They want the understanding, not that fake, phony stuff. Even though some people will still watch the fake, phony stuff and be entertained. And I'm not knocking. But on top of me never using violence, I try to, you know, come all different type of ways. Because what is the vocabulary kingdom? It's not skinny little hell. time in Cold Town. No matter of fact, Snub got life in Cold Township. On the hat, Snub nigga. Snub Uzi Sellies. Free Nitty, he's still in Cold Township doing 15 to 30. Can, can, can I give y'all a little history five, lesson? The bigger yeah. one, man. Back in the day, it was I had a group. I was in a group called Exile. Right? Mm -hmm. That's where all I'm at now. Two of them got life in prison right now for murders. Separate, different type of murders. And I went down for a murder. I'm the only one made it out. And you want to know what? It wasn't all the same murder. It was three different murders we got charged for. Mm. This is my original OBH rap group. I started OBH all in prison for killing people. Mm -hmm. This is my group. Y'all understand why people feel you don't play with me? Because mm -hmm. before they heard me, you got to understand, before they heard me, when I met Cassidy, mm -hmm. you know how I met Cassidy? How you met Cassidy? Because he He's pulled broke. up on me and he said, hey, man, I need, I need a nigga like you around me, man. <laughs> he said, Bobby out in New York, man, these boys got killers in there. I don't got nobody like you around me. Two months, uh, the next day he ran down on me and said somebody was trying to extort him mm. and trying to hurt him. Most of those shit, I was charged with a murder. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. OBA! In North Philadelphia right now. Sky Fox is over the scene where five people have... In North Philadelphia right now. Sky Fox is over the scene where five people have been shot, two people have died, a woman and a man. Now, from what Dave Schratweiser tells us, the other three people are not hurt seriously. Right now, talking to Police Commissioner Ross. Let's listen in. Westbound on Huntington and then south on 12th Street, firing uh, rounds at this group. There appear to be several people uh, standing on the corner, uh, southeast corner of 12th and Huntington. Uh, from the evidence out here, it appears to be a large uh, caliber uh, weapon. Uh, and then you said, I just read it. Okay, so then it carries on, okay? Right. So then now y'all texting and now you calling him. No, he texted you and said Cass. So that was him who texted you? Yes, he texted me first with his name. Just let me know it was hell. Okay. And then you said hi. And then he was like, what's up with you? And you was like, nothing. What you doing? He likes smoking and relaxing. Where you at? And then he said, and send a pic so I know it's official. And you was like, I'm on my way to Jersey. And a pic of what? And he was like, a pic of you or whatever you like. And then you was like, I want to see something from you too, daddy. But I definitely <laughs> got you. Ooh. So then you send him this with your boobs and your booty and stuff out. Yes. And then he told you he didn't know if he could trust you yet. Right. And then you basically told him, listen, I'm not trying to be rude, but how are you going to say you can't trust me with a pic? That's really silly. Like, that's crazy. Like, what the fuck? wrong with sending me a pic how do i know i am to trust you and i'm coming to jersey so wait why so something is missing here you were on your way to jersey already to set up the sex or what no, I was, i'm from jersey so i was on my way to jersey to meet up with my best friend who was in edison new jersey at the time so i was on my way to go meet up with her and um so i was like that's why i said i'm already on my way to jersey and when he called me we you know because we were talking on the phone as well it was like we were talking on the phone we were texting us back and forth he was like well while i'm in jersey why not come and check him out because he was in jersey city at the time mm -hmm. and addison and jersey city is like probably like 45 minutes away from each other and um basically you know doing the we was texting about the um wife because i wanted to know what she looked like uh -huh. and things like that and you know we was conversating about her he saw me pictures of the wife he sent me pictures of the, um, of, you know, him. So He's, you were I guess going he to Jersey to meet up with your friend, but you were going to meet up with him at the same time. 
I was going to go see my friend while I was in Jersey. I was going to go meet up with him as well. Yes. Okay, so, right. Let's hold that thought. Let's, let's, let's pull up these next receipts. <laughs> okay, so now, he actually ended up sending you a picture of him. Okay, so, <laughs> so with that being said, let me ask you this. Are you pre-op or post-op? I'm, um, I'm post-op. Okay, so you have a vagina. I do now, yes. So he could have possibly thought you were a real woman. No, because me and Cassidy, if you check the date, that was way before my surgery. Mm -hmm. Me and Cassidy didn't mess around. I had just recently got my surgery at least five months ago. He could have possibly thought you were a real woman. No, because me and Cassidy, if you check the date, that was way before my surgery. Mm -hmm. Me and Cassidy didn't mess around. I had just recently got my surgery at least five months ago, so. Niggas is, these niggas is garbage, man. They can't Cassidy's really rap. They're not really in the streets. They're not really piecing up no real bars. Word. They're not really doing the shit they see. They're doing these raps. The only reason why you probably hearing them on the radio a lot and seeing they video a lot the money. is because they got like little weird situations with niggas. I don't know if it's like a homosexual situation, some believing in a devil type situation, some born against the grain situation. <laughs> niggas be doing any and anything they got to do to get in position. I'm not willing to do that, so you might not hear me on the record. You know, you may you, you might lose your clothes listening to this. Don't listen to this information if if you looking for violence. If you if if you know Please, it's the kingdom of kingdoms of vocabulary of, of kingdom. You going you catch a headache out of this book by um Chade Tan. If it's a squid, don't tolerate nothing. Because they're always testing you. Diamonds. You know what I mean? That's how it is. It's so much stuff. It was so much stuff. I just gathered some ooze just to get the pictures in order. Take hours. I need attention. That's what they doing. Phone, phone, zoom in, phone. I am your father. Everything that people do, they mock in Jesus. I could never mock Jesus and God. I'd be shaking in my boots. I mean, I melted my own skin just playing with God. I don't even test God. Mm -mm. I lay that up to a booger. Just like this, similar is rituals. Wouldn't want to be around. Mm -hmm. Demands. That sounds familiar. We know the bar for men is dead, just element, but a different type, different type, you know, Book of Joshua, chapter 10, killing the five kings, you know, this is why we have the eighth God, because there's the six, there's the seven, then there's the eighth, then there's the shadow God, then there's everything that come as a package. The hymn vijana wanauawa. Last week wameua kijana wa shule na namba ya watoto wa shule ambao wameuawa kwa kipindi cha miezi nane watoto wa shule wao na polisi ni watoto wa nane kutoka Mombasa. Yusi tumejika mwingine katana, Mariakani tumeona na in the demons. We see what's going on to the very old 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 angel powers gave over the power to these to the world and it just so happened that and we're fighting we're fighting that's the meaning the whole purpose of evil and and um a different squid so once the squid is in process the squid could help the other squids do what they do in the world around the world hated jesus with no cause for no reason oh he he prophesied he was sent here for sacrifice. So I'm saying, how can you love God if God didn't implant Jesus already into your heart and mind? Like, stay a squid. I never done no double stuff. Piece of the cookie crumb. Because they ain't, they ain't, the life that they do have is oozed out. We're scattered out everywhere people so you very few listen to this we in severe end time we in severe end times and um new stuff coming soon spin them around spin them around ooze juice diamonds shane song shadow gods you 
will fall short. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit? The Lin Kuei shredded us. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. Come on now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one, Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees. From the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. It's pretty hard not to. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. <laughs> You'll never know how I felt It's like nine days, saying nine days Like Ed man for himself Even the hardest man gon' melt If you don't hear the truth, then you dealt If you ain't real as me, then you step We was kidnapped and then kept No one perfect by a long shot you Got your hands up with your nose out But I'ma shut it down with these vocals I'ma do the stand like I'm posted Had to toughen up when he showed you Try to slow me down and they froze you Never pay back cause I don't owe you Let the water heat and then boil you If ain't one thing, it's another If ain't one demon, it's another No matter how many come after me It'll never be no other Try to stick to me but no butter I'ma cut them down with these cutters Trying to rule with me but no stutter Jesus been my dad and my mother I got a lot of stuff on my mind Get it off my chest Sometimes I ask myself Wonder if I'm next How much of that abuse can you take? They digging all of my plate Blocking all of my space Now they want to help but I'm sure how much that abuse not can you take I done pay my dues a day by day Nothing gonna hold that back no more All that anger inside had let go I got a lot of stuff on my mind Get it off my chest Sometimes I ask myself Wonder if I'm next How much of that abuse can you take They digging all of my plate Blocking all of my space Now you wanna help but I'm straight Took a few blows, got bruised up Been trying not to get chewed up Everyone that I know Out of dead or sick or they screwed up They mad at us cause he chose us We can ride it out like two trucks I'm hard to get like two bucks If you down with Satan, that's too tough I don't want a girl who's used up That's just the way that I see it Trying to find the keys cause I need it And I don't roll with them cause they greedy If it multiply then I treat it If you ain't down then I leave it Yo, every move is a still glance They never gave me a real chance Then you teaching stuff to your children 
Are you about the stuff that you live in? I'm fighting all of these villains. Had to get up out my feelings. Then I sit up on that base. Had to get back, gotta get that. Gotta get up out my way. Trying to mess up all my day. I got a lot of stuff on my mind. Get it off my chest. Sometimes I ask myself, wonder if I'm next. How much of that abuse can you take? They digging all of my plate. Blocking all of my space. Now they want to help, but I'm sure. How much that abuse now can you take? I done pay my dues, said day by day Nothing gonna hold me back no more All that anger inside had let go How much that abuse now can you take? I done pay my dues, said day by day Nothing gonna hold me back no more All that anger inside had let go So you figured it out yet? Should have figured it out, man. How much you willing to take? Uh. What is it going to take? It's up to you.